Hello, thanks for dropping by. Today, we'll be showing you how easily you can produce a stable Geiger multi-blade damper with connection rods all by yourself. This type of damper can be built in one piece up to 2,000 mm in width and up to 2,500 mm in height. All the required parts are engineered and produced in-house by us. We will of course provide you with the assembly plan. First of all, you have to cut blades and frame parts to the required length. Now put the bearings into the frame profiles. The closed bearings are used on the opposite side of the drive shaft but you can also use the open bearings on both sides. In the next step, the frame is connected with the corners. Optionally, you can manufacture the frames with conventional air duct profiles and inserted sheet metal. We use clinching technology. You can, of course, also join by spot welding or riveting. On one side, the frame remains open. Now put the end caps into the blades. For the blade on which the drive shaft will be mounted, we use the end cap from the drive lever set. This end cap is prepared for fixing the drive shaft. The blades are placed side by side in the frame. The blade with the end cap for the drive shaft has to be placed in the centre. Once all blades are in the right position, you can close and fix the frame. The rod levers have to be put on the end caps. The lever of the drive shaft is secured with a pin. There's a choice of a 14 mm round and a 15 by 15 mm square drive shaft. All the other rod levers are fixed with a screw. Then the end cap of the drive shaft is secured with screws. Next, the rubber edge seals are placed in the slots of the blade profiles. For preparing the rod sections, please insert the sleeve bearing bushings. The connector set is fixed with two rod sections. A look at the assembly chart might be helpful to understand the design. After this, the rod sections have to be put on the rod levers and secured with retaining rings. Connect the stop brackets with the frame. In order to seal and stabilize the corners, fix small angle brackets mounted from the outside onto the frame. Finally, seal the internal corners with sealing compound. 
the damper with connection rods is ready to use. With a drive arm adapter set, you can use various drive shafts on the required blade position instead of the shafts made of zinc die casting. This type of damper is also available as an airtight damper or for a service temperature range from minus 40 degrees Celsius to plus 200 degrees Celsius. You will find further variants of build-it-yourself kits for multi-blade dampers, weather-resistant louvers and flexible connectors on our website or on our YouTube channel. Our sales team will be happy to support and advise you. Feel free to contact us.